Hi, I'm Dennis from Ceramic Speed. Today I'm going to do the installation of the Campagnolo oversized pulley wheel system. Here I'm going to show it on the mechanical, but it's the same for the EPS electronic version of Campagnolo. To start with, I'm going to take off the chain and the wheel to get free access to the cage of the rear trailer. First I'm going to take off the chain. The old chain, we won't need it anymore since the oversized pulley wheel system will use a longer chain. Now I'm taking off the wheel to get the free access to the cage from both sides. Next step is to adjust the rear trailer, make free space that it can go through the frame without touching. To get the installation full done, I would need the oversized pulley wheel system I would need Allen key 5, Allen key 3, the Allen key 2 and a Phillips screwdriver. First step is to take the standard pulley wheels away from the cage. For that I would need the Allen key 3. I will start with the upper pulley. The upper pulley, I'll put it over here, we will not need that anymore. Loosen the lower pulley as well to get free access to the pivot bolt on the back side. Next step is to take the Allen key 5 and loosen up the pivot bolt. Hold with your one hand the cage because there is a still a spring tension on the cage. Loosen the bolt and let the spring tension release. Next step is to remove the cage including the spring. We need and reuse the spring, the metal washer and the pivot bolt. The rest we do not reuse in this installation. Unbox the oversized pulley wheel system. In the box you will find the oversized pulley wheel system, the sticker sheet and as well the ceramic speed pulley wheel oil. Now when installing the oversized pulley wheel system, put a little bit of grease around the pivot bolt hole, take the pivot bolt, push it through. Add the metal washer on the top and put the spring in the second hole marked M on the cage. Next step is to mount the oversized pulley wheel system into the housing. Make sure that the spring is attached correctly in the housing. Tighten the pivot bolt gently. Now the oversized pulley wheel system should be able to move freely. Next step is to loosen the bolt to put tension on the spring. I'm loosening the pivot bolt, turning the oversized system counterclockwise seen from the front and clockwise seen from the left side. Move the cage past the stop of the housing, retighten the pivot bolt. You should now have spring tension on the OSPW. Next step is to install the chain. Campagnolo comes standard wise with 114 links. We recommend you to shorten it down to 110 to 112 links. Make sure that the chain is above the tower inside the oversized system. Installing the chain, I'm using the original connecting pin. We're now ready to install the wheel. When installing the wheel, 
pull back the oversized system to get free access for the cassette to make sure that the gear will work you might need to adjust the upper and the lower stop for the EPS system please go into Campagnolo's website that you can find how to adjust the EPS system it is important that the upper pulley wheel is not touching the big chain ring on the cassette for this adjust the B tension this is done right here I'm now running through all the gears to make sure the oversized system works through all the gears. You're now ready to ride your new oversized pulley wheel system from Campagnolo. Have a nice ride.